Stompy Stomperson. <laughs> we got a random hit number five. I think he's doing it as a joke, and he'll probably come in the chat and announce, but we'll see. Uh, number five, definitive, we got Dennis, Jason, Crowder, Jaron, Steven, Crowder for a second, Dave, and Stomper. Custom name in the chat, I should ask, would anybody else like a custom name in the chat? Anybody at all? Dave, you want something with the Raptors in there for you? Crowder, go Cubbies? Rizzo? Anybody else? Are you guys good to go? I don't want to make it look like I'm playing favorites. Anybody want a custom name? <laughs> and Dave, did you pick the box yet, bro? If you don't want to, you don't have to. I can have uh, whoever was in front. Crowder can pick it, or he can pass too. F stump. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's pretty freaking funny. F Stomper. The best part is after the break when I forget who's is who's. Left. All right. Thank you, Dave. And you would like Jtron. Okay. That works. Anybody else? Going once, going twice. We're going to open up the box. Just want to make sure I didn't miss anybody asking for custom. Fur burger. I should be able to remember that. Okay. Good luck, everyone. We're going to take this down. And see what's hiding in here. Fifth one. We will have one left after this. I wanted to try to do that last third case as a full case. So we all drum up something for Ronnie this weekend. Either that or you guys will see it next week. Pretty full box here. No frame in there. That's surprising. Other case we had what four frames total, one in each box. I think we did have a box without a frame. All right, we just peek real quick for relics that are playing. Nope, we got two nice patches on the bottom. We'll do those first though. We got eight cards in there. One, two, three, four. We got eight cards. Perfect. No bonuses this time around. Okay. Up first, I haven't even peeked. That card. The Relics. First one. Freddie Freeman. Nice colors. Nice break. 39 out of 50. And we have 8, 4, 7, 2, 0, 4. JC, if you want to look it up. These are the wrong size sleeves. Rookie breaker. Gosh. You want the Freddy? You're going to get the Freddy. I'm calling it now. That's the fur burger. Second up. Beautiful card. Cutter, yeah. 9 out of 15. Triple color. That's pretty green. Number on that, if you want to look it up again, 846-787-JC. Red Auto 1 of 1, second 1 of 1 in this case. Woo! I ran into a hot case without even realizing it. 2 1 of 1 so far, we didn't have any in the last, last night's case. Damn, man. One of one Rhino inscription. Sandberg. I know who's going to want that. F Stomper. Wow, that's a beauty. Little streaky on the ink. Rhino, one of one. Five cards left. Little streaky ink, yep. Little streaky. I think you'd still be happy with that one, though, right? A couple rookie autos here. Well, at least one, actually. I'm not sure if there's two. Oh, man. Beautiful card coming up next. Christian Stewart, 23 out of 50. There's our first rookie auto. It's roughly one to two per box, so they're not overwhelming this year. That's good. Christian Stewart. We had one frame in box one. Yep. Oh, wow. This is a good box. First. 11 out of 11. Mariano Rivera. The Sandman. 11 World Series saves is the inscription there. Defining Moments autograph card. I think that's one of the case hits. 
on that list of 10 to 11 case hits. What a freaking autograph, though. Man. Best SIG in the biz. 11 out of 11. That is really cool, actually. I just realized that's because he's got 11 World Series saves. That is gorgeous. It's so awesome. Oh, uh, this next card. This next card is something else. Dual Auto. Emerald. Oh my god, we have another 101. <laughs> well, I slightly regret selling my spots for this break. First up, Big Mac and Will Clark, two of the best sluggers from the 90s. Look at that autograph on the Clark, 8 out of 10, and the Big Mac is pretty damn sharp, too. First glance, I did think that was Canseco and Big Mac, but Clark and McGuire, nice, too. Anybody know the significance of those two that they share together? West Coast. Dual autograph card, Will Clark. Mark McGuire doesn't say anything on the back. Were they batting champions a few years together, something like that? Home run leaders, RBI leaders, maybe something. Nice card. This next card is a monster, and it's the biggest card we've hit out of Definitive. Holy hell. And I'm going to make you wait. Bottom card. Played in the World Series together. Nice. Did not know that. Posada. Hip, hip, Jorge. 27 out of 50. Noted for the 27 World Championships. Beautiful pinstripe. You guys ready for this last card? This was the box of Definitive. And that makes three one-of-ones in this total case, and there's still a box left. There's the Posada. And... Oh, man. Only thing that could make this better if it was last year's version, because it would have been his rookie. Logo Man, one of one, with ink, of quite possibly the hottest hitter in baseball. Not named Cody Bellinger. Damn, that's beautiful. <laughs> Let me sleeve it. Let me sleeve it. Oh my god, that's beautiful. Navy, gray, logo man. Damn, that's sharp. Wowzers! Well, uh, at least one, two, three, four, five of you are going home happy. The Posada is not a whammy. The Correa patch is nice. The Christian Stewart, obviously, that's going to suck to hit it. Them be the breaks. Good luck to you all. Here comes the randomizer, guys. Hell of a box of definitive. That's why we rip this stuff. For the hot boxes, the hot cases. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll pop this up. There we go. I don't think anyone's selling their boxes. Yeah, I agree, Crowder. I agree. But I'm really antsy to see what's in it. Okay. Got all you guys typed up. We're going to type up the hits live so you see me do it right here. Glaber logo. Posada. Dual auto. Mo, Christian Stewart, unfortunately. Oh, someone's got to hit it, though. Sandberg in the last two, Correa and Freeman. Okay. You guys ready for this? <laughs> yes, it did. Yes, it did. Good luck, fellas. This is the highest intensity one we've had so far. Fresh dice, remember? Got to be three or higher on three rolls. Here's the roll. One. Two and final roll. Glad I glad I said that rule. <laughs> One additional roll. We got snake eyes. There it is. Six presses. We do need ominous music. Unfortunately, I don't have that. That'd be great to have a soundboard though. I've said that for years actually. We need a soundboard for breaks. Six presses. Names first. Here's one, two, three. Come on. 
Five and six. Jtron in the top. Steven at the eight spot. Here go the cards. Six times. Ah. Good luck, dudes. Final press. Boom. Freeman to Jtron. Correa to Dennis. Sandberg to F Stomper. Dual auto to Stomper. Glaybar logo goes to Furberger. Congratulations, Dave. <laughs> Crowder unfortunately got the Christian, but you got the 101 Sandberg at least. Mo goes to Jaron, and the Posada goes to Steven T. Furberger for the win. Awesome. Wow. Crowder, PSA the Sandberg, or you don't want it in the slab for your PC? Definitely would get a 9 auto if you BGS it. Beautiful card, though. I think I did all right. I think I did all right. <laughs> I'll show the cards one more time as I go here. Uh, Jay, you got the Freeman. Dennis Correa for you. 9 out of 15. Sandberg Crowder. Awesome Rhino inscription right there. Glabar 101, my God. Well done, Dave T. with the Furburger name. Wins it. Little beautiful logo there. Christian Stewart. Crowder. Com C special for you. Rivera goes to Jaron. That is such a beautiful card. 11 out of 11. That is really, really nice. Uh, dual Auto. Jose. 8 out of 10. Big Mac, Will Clark. Or no, that was Stomper. <laughs> and the Posada. Last card goes to Stephen T. Good stuff. If you guys want to run it back, we got one more loose box. Kind of tough to let that last box go unopened, but Ronnie will be around on the weekend, too. Let me save this vid. I'll be right back.